you guys, it's Lindsay here, and I am so excited to bring to you my very first unboxing video. Um, I am a huge fan of these monthly subscription boxes. I have a subscription to Pop Sugar, which is kind of just like a kind of like an everything box that includes like home goods and snacks and um, fashion and jewelry and things like that. I also get two different subscription boxes for like cruelty free vegan makeup and I even get my weekly meals delivered to me every week too through Green Chef so I hardly ever go grocery shopping other than the regular things that I need every week. So I was thrilled when I came across Stash Builder Box. Um, Stash Builder Box is a monthly subscription box just for sewists. Um, its owner, Amanda Kelly, she lives out in Utah and she started this really to kind of um, explore her love for, sh for sewing and also to help um, give back. So 20% of all the proceeds from Stash Builder Box go to providing kids in need with quilts which I think is a really great cause. Um, so let's get right into seeing what is in June's box. Um, it literally was delivered to me yesterday and I've been holding out um, all this time to dig into it. I'm so excited to see what's here. If you're not familiar with how these subscription boxes work, it's basically like a theme usually and it's a curation of random products that you may or may not have heard of before um, that you um, kind of it's like a mystery box like you don't really know what's inside every month and but if you're into whatever the theme is like sewing or beauty or whatever then you're inevitably really going to love what's in your box so um, this is the box it's very simple just has a cute little sticker on top it says stash builder box with the website and it's sealed with like a gold little piece of tape here really easy to get into and then when you open it up it says in the cover here it says hello and welcome to your box by purchasing this box you help change a life to find out more visit stashbuilderbox.com slash heart builders and as I already said um, that is her program where she donates a portion of the proceeds to um, kids in need and you can also volunteer through her website website to help uh, make the quilts. So if you're not into buying a box, but you still want to help her cause you can do that there. Okay And the card says creativity is intelligence having fun by Albert Einstein. I love that so cute Yeah, and on the other side it has um, a little synopsis of what's inside So I'm not gonna look too much at that because I don't want to be a spoiler Okay, so first thing is a coupon. It looks like 10% off anything from Sevenly.com. Sevenly looks like it's probably one of those graphic t-shirt companies. This one says, you may say I'm a dreamer. I'm not the only one. That's really cute. But it's like a t-shirt, see? So you get a coupon code for that. So I'll have to go check out Sevenly and see if there's any cute sayings that I like. Um, next up, there is this linen bag. It has stamped with a stash builder box stamp. Um, the little tagline is the box with the cause. That's really cute. I could also imagine using this bag. I don't know if that was her intention, but um, it's a really cute, well done little bag. I wonder if she makes the bags herself. Interesting. Anyways, let's see what's inside. Lots of things. So the first thing is a pencil. It looks like, yeah, it's just like a lead pencil. Um, keep calm and get the seam ripper is what it says on there. That's really cute. Yeah, I'm always using a pencil. I'm jotting down notes if I'm making pattern alterations. Um, I'm jotting down what I'm doing like in the instruction booklet so that I can remember for the next time what I've done. So cute pencil. Here is some thread. 100% cotton from Aurafil. Let's see. It's like this really bold yellow color. Yeah, canary yellow. Ideal for detailed machine embroidery, quilting, lace design, and serging. Long stable cotton gives this thread the strength it needs, the strength needed for high speed machines. Cool, bright red, bright yellow orophil thread, 200 meters, that's cool. 
Next is these little things. There's two of them. They kind of look like hair clips or almost like wishbones. They are bobbin buddies. This clever hairpin-like design lets you store your bobbins with their matching spools of thread suitable for most thread spools and bobbins. That's cool. I want to try it. Hold on. Let me go get uh, some thread and a bobbin. Hold on. Okay, I'm back. Thread, bobbin. It's just like a regular Guterman thread, and this is the, whatever, six millimeter bobbins that Brother Machines use. So there's not really any instructions with them, um, it, but it looks like... From the picture, you stack the bobbin on top of the thread and then you pinch this little guy right inside. <laughs> That's so cool, look. Awesome! I don't know what you, I feel like I should be using this as a hook for something. Like I should start storing my thread on hooks or something. Maybe for those of you that have the, that pegboard, this might be a good idea for like calming colors, black, white, cream. Um, also a really good idea if you travel to sew, like I'll go to Abby's or she'll come here to um, sew together sometimes. So this is a great way to take your thread and your, and your bobbin all in one. Or if you go to like sewing class or something like that. I love this. There's only two of them though. I wish, <laughs> I wish there were more. I think they're really cute and they work really well. I mean, I don't know that you'd be shaking around your stuff, but it's not going anywhere, people. If anything, the thread's gonna come unwound before anything else. Cool, I love those. Bobbin Buddies are what those are called. I'll probably go and try and find some more of these. Awesome. What else? It's a little pin, I Heart SBB, that, with a sewing machine on it. That's really cute. If you're into collecting pins, I'll probably pin mine to my cork board. Um, then we have True Grips, non-slip adhesive rings. Apply to the back of any ruler. Okay, and True Grips, uh, says enhance your ruler for straight precise cuts true grips prevent slipping which increases safety transparent for easy fabric visibility simply stick to the back of any ruler cool I obviously these are for quilters I'm not a huge quilter um, but I do use a quilting ruler a lot in garment sewing if I'm trying to trace a straight line like the center back of a dress or a shirt or something, I will use a ruler for that. I use a ruler a lot whenever I'm tracing, um, like to my um, tracing paper from the pattern. Um, so I do use a ruler a lot all the time. I can't say for sure that I've had an issue with it slipping around, but maybe I just didn't realize it and it has been. Either way, these are like super thin, like little, you know those three ring binder stickers that you can put on your papers so that they don't rip out of the three ring binder? They look like that, but clear and adhesive on both sides, I guess. But you get 15 of them with this little pack. So that's kind of cool. Then there is like black tissue paper with a sticker on it that says enjoy. And it looks like stash block of the month. Oh, so it's a quilting block of the month. This is the Indian hatchet block. Share your block. And yeah, it's just like instructions for making that Indian hatchet block. That's kind of cool. Honestly, well, so you see the blanket that's in the background of all of our videos. I, that's a quilt that I actually made. It's like a, a crib size quilt. And I have been getting an inkling to change my colors in the living room. But that quilt really inspired all the colors in here. So I'd have to make another quilt in order to do that, I feel like. So maybe if I get enough of these block of the months, then that will help keep me focused and motivated. And I could just do a little bit each month. What's this one? Stash pick of the month. This is the Lily Ella Stitchery Scrappy Litter Blocks. Oh my gosh, it's a cat quilt. It's a cat quilt pattern. <laughs> I don't know what Sunny would think about having a cat quilt, but in a way it could be a dog or a fox maybe. I do have a friend who, actually two friends who have cats. One of them is slightly more obsessed than the other. So maybe for like a really nice gift or something, you can make this for them. And it's really, the little booklet is only like a few pages because it's, the, it's a repetitive block. You, it's just one pattern and you just attach them all together. Huh, that's really cute. Cute, so yeah, I guess 
I, I'm imagining in every box every month you'll get a block of the month and you'll also get a pick of the month. Now I don't know if pick of the month is always going to be a quilting pattern or not. Maybe it would be a garment. That would be really cool. I don't know. So those are the other two things that are called included in there. And then we also have some fabric. It looks like this fabric comes from Fabric Worm, which I've heard of before. Um, so special discount just for Stash Builder Box. So it's a little coupon for that. And then there's fabric. In, oh, three, three things of fabric in here. I think I'm assuming these are going to be fat quarters. Hold on. So Cloud9 fabrics. This is the Glint Collection in Jim Gray, Lush Black, and Florette Blue. Cute. Again, I'm not much of a quilter, but you know what these would be really good for? I think they even have a book out there for fat quarters, like little scrappy projects that you can make. So remember the video that I posted about the keychains? That would be really cute for either of these. Or, I mean, you can never have too many cosmetic bags. Or, you know what, honestly, I will probably use these for is pocket linings. I love to do fun little things with pocket linings. And I've been really into making shorts lately. You'll see a video on that pretty soon. Um, so these would be so perfect for, for pocket linings because they're woven and they don't stretch. Um, so as a, as a garment sewer, that's probably what I would use these for. But they're really, really cute. And there's something else here in the bottom. Oh, <laughs> confetti. Yay! Awesome! So that's everything that is in the June Stash Builder Box. Um, again, I'm just so thrilled that someone started putting these together because I have been buying beauty boxes for years and years, probably four or five years since I first heard of them. I just thought it was so cool to have somebody out there sourcing the coolest of the cool things um, out there. And now uh, Amanda is doing that for us in the sewing and quilting world. So that's really cool. Also, what's really cool is Amanda has set up a, um, like a coupon code for all of our viewers, which we are just so thrilled to be able to share with you. So if you want $3 off your very first box, just put inside the hem in the coupon code box during checkout. And I hope that you will enjoy your stash builder box as much as I do. I think this first one for me was really great. Very inspired and can't wait to use all the new stuff. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you all next time.